Hey guys, welcome to another SaaS landing page teardown. Today we have uh, Gather, which is um, you know essentially a design project management tool just for the interior designers, which basically helps you track uh, where are the, where's the furniture, if everything matches, get approval for clients, get the budgeting rights, get the right specs for the builders, and so on and so forth. So that's basically what it does. And today I'm going to do something slightly different, where I'm just going to tear down a page of a client instead of a, just a normal SaaS company to kind of explain some of the decisions that were made in order to make it uh, this really clear, right? So before we even show the headline, we actually show the uh, everything that is in place, like the different people in the team, the budgeting, everything is on track. They can have everything in one place to kind of preview what it's going to look like, right? To see if you're on track budget-wise or not. It generates spec books and proposals and spec sheets, which is something they really want because otherwise it's going to be a total nightmare in order to get it. And we show it right away, right, right from the beginning, like the aha moments right away. Then we talk about uh, other tools where you have to kind of duct tape them together. Uh, and it's just a, a really big pain because it's really important to always talk about the problem before you even uh, present the solution to kind of remind them of the problem. Just like a sales call, if they don't admit they have the problem or you don't remind them of the problem, they're rarely going to buy because you know, they, you're know you never going to sell them on a solution. They don't think they, on a problem they don't think they have, right? Um, so we just have some social proof here, which is a really good video testimonial that they got. And then essentially we talk about explaining the product, right? So what we do is we talk about from the process of starting a project to delivering it, what are all the ways that Gather makes it 10 times better, like just miles better, right? So here's they can track every single item and ger generate mistake-free spec sheets, packages, and proposals, which basically means that you take, um, uh, you basically take all the items that you get, that, that for example, you want this lamp, you want this chair, you want this countertop, and it generates uh, all these files that they otherwise have to generate manually of what are the sizes, how long does it take to ship, how much do they cost, how much do they wait because of the transporting, uh, all these little things to make sure uh, that everything gets installed properly. Uh, they also have this little video, which is literally um, a Loom video going through how the product works, which is low production, but it looks great and it's super easy to uh, explain, right? It's literally uh, basically what I'm doing here, but the client chose to not use the face just to have more emphasis on the product, right? Exact same thing. Uh, then what we're doing is we're explaining the things in order, right? So what we're saying here is, Here's how you can clip inspiration, furnishing materials, and so on in two clicks, which is basically, and what we're showing here, without uh, using anything uh, besides like uh, GIFs of the product and stuff like that, which is, this literally can take 30 seconds to, to do, is they show the aha moment, like the visual side of someone going on the website saying, I want this lamp, I'm gonna click save, and then it's gonna show up automatically and gather with all the dimensions and everything. It has the images, it has the name, the description, it has a link back to the website where you found it. Essentially, this is going to be amazing, right? We even say that it's similar to Pinterest, but for um, for just uh, interior design stuff with the projects themselves, right? Then we talk about visualizing everything in one place. So basically, this means that let's say I'm doing the living room, I can see all the items in one in one place if I'm hitting the budget and, and everything, right? Then we answer uh, common questions, but is Gather powerful enough for my most complex projects, right? Even if you have hundreds of items, attachments, and a ton of spec uh, specifications is able to handle it, right? For those big companies that maybe have thousands of items, right? Then you can share it and discuss it with your clients, right? You can get approval, you can change the stage, you can say it's approved, not approved, so on and so forth, right? Which is what we explained here. Then you can add notes, when it was delivered, has it been approved? Has it been, uh, have I ordered this already, right? Essentially, I'm going through everything that they need to do in, in the design process and showing how it's going to be a million times better, right? Then we're going to talk about all the time that you're going to save generating all these types of documents, the idea board to present to the clients, the installation guides based on the website's instructions for when they order things, the spec sheets for the builders to actually uh, um, do the, the, the changes in the house, like all the, all the actual work. Then we talk about the onboarding experience, which at least we show someone in the team going over uh, and explaining how the product works, right? To make it really easy to understand. Uh, some social proof of people that got better results and then just talking about that they are just five minutes away from actually trying this out. They can do unlimited pro projects doing the 
free trial. They can get free onboarding during the free trial and then they can cancel at any time, right? So these are all the decisions I made in order to make sure that the product is as clear as possible. Let me know what you think about it in the comments. And um, yeah, if you want help getting uh, your own website rewritten and explained with all these detail, um, just let me know on LinkedIn, send me a DM and we can uh, work it out from there. Or you just go to here, Cortez.design and you book your uh, initial call to make sure that um, we are like a good fit, right? So you just schedule your strategy sessions, figure out if you're a good fit, and then we take it from there. Cheers.